Hello everyone. Here we will discuss about the ID3 decision tree algorithm based upon the given data set with 14 samples. In this 14 samples, 9 samples are positive, 5 samples are negative classes. So this is having 4 attributes outlook, temperature, humidity, wind and we are having the output label is player tennis. This is again binary class classification. So we are having uh, two boolean values yes and no. Here the ID3 algorithm is first following the uh, root initiation. First we have to select the root node. We have to select the root node. So here we are having four attributes outlook with three values. What are the three values? Outlook is having uh, sunny, overcast and we are having rainy. And like that we are having the wind. Wind is normal and you look at here wind is strong and weak. Wind is having strong and weak. So like that another is temperature. Temperature is having three values hot, mild and cool. Hot, mild and cool. And another one uh, attribute is having the humidity. Humidity is again we are having two values. One is normal and another one is high. Normal and high. So based upon this attribute value pair we have to find out the entropy information gain of each and every node whichever in, in uh, attribute is giving more information that will be selecting as a best attribute so initially we have to create the root node for the tree so for that we are having different cases if all the training samples are belonging to single class positive that means all the 14 samples are belonging to the positive class then we can make the single node single node single attribute that attribute outlook attribute outlook is root of the tree then we can make all the samples to belonging to the positive class yes like this this is the first one another one if all the samples are negative class if all the samples are negative class then we can create root node with the label of this is the root node outlook then all the samples belonging all 14 samples belonging to uh, negative class then we can say only the label no. So third case if attributes is empty attribute is not having any value then we can take here the outlook all the samples belonging to whichever target value suppose my target value is having positive then i can take into the positive class so these three conditions okay otherwise all the samples not negative all the samples not positive and there is more number of attributes available if it is the case then what we have to do we have to start with calculating the entropy we have to select any one of the attribute from list of attributes that best classifies best classifies how can we do the uh, select the best attribute by calculating the information gain so whichever attribute is giving more information to find the solution that will be selected as best attribute so that is considered as a a so now the a is assumed as a root node a is assumed as a root node for example in this case we will select outlook so here the outlook is considered as a best attribute initially now we are taking outlook is best attribute based upon the calculating information gain this is again assumption so this is the now best attribute a 
then for each possible value so what are the values available here sunny or uh, overcast rainy so for each possible value of attribute we have to form new tree new sub tree below the root new sub tree below the root for checking each and every value of given attribute so here we have to make the sub tree for sunny then we have to make the sub tree for overcast and third one we have to make the sub tree for the rainy okay then let examples belonging to the value so say, take the examples belonging to the sunny and also let say, take the examples belonging to the overcast and let take the examples to the rainy right so that is the next one then for examples if all the examples are empty okay if all the examples value that value is empty then blow this new branch add the leaf now suppose i am having four samples you look at that four samples suppose my in overcast in overcast right all the all the samples are belonging to same class if it is like that then add all this in until under overcast otherwise blow this new branch blow this new branch add the subtree add the subtree how can you take the subtree we have to select one more attribute in this three attributes which is the best attribute for outlook equal to some value outlook equal to some value so examples to the particular value right examples to the particular value here we can take one value is sunny one time then target attribute which attribute we have to select we can we have to select right we have to select uh, the, the target attribute is here that uh, outcome label target value right here list of attributes list of attributes either wind temperature humidity we have to select that one for the value sunny next time for the value rainy third time we have to select for the value overcast so again we have to go back again we have to go back right so finally we will return the root we will return the root so this is the way to uh, construct the decision tree by using the id3 algorithm we will see the example in next video Thanks for watching.